Okay, today we're going to talk about iodine deficiency and also to happen to dog too. You see him shivering? Right now it's about 65 degree and he is shivering. See that? He's really shivering because he's iodine deficiency. And I learned that recently and he lost a lot of weight. He's very skinny now. Um, and he does lost, lost, he did lost, lost a lot of weight until I actually found out this recently that him and I actually the iodine deficiency. I have that video, oops, sorry, hitting the, hitting the tripod there. I have video up here. I talked about how I found out about iodine deficiency and, um, And it was a, uh, it was it, this actually a really hard journey. And for anyone who's out there who is iodine deficiency, I just want to let you know that it is a hard journey. But you have to be. Uh, you can either have go have a blood test, or you can be your own doctor. That's up to you. Um, this is not a medical diagnosis or anything of that nature. I need to put that warning ahead of time. Uh, this is about my story and how my dog is iodine deficiency. And yes, dog actually are, is and are iodine deficiency as well. Um, if they don't have enough. Um, and if you look at certain food, they actually have, uh, they put iodide in there. So... Um, like for instance, if you look at Perina Alpo, um, I actually have it. Let me move this a little bit. Sorry. I wasn't intend to do that, but I guess I will. And you would see it. No, Benny. I don't know. It's, uh. Right there. Potassium iodide. So literally they knew. They knew that actually dog actually um, have iodine deficiency. And you can see how shaky he is right now. Normally he doesn't shake like that. Only recently when he, he lost a lot of weight. That's when I started to notice that he started acting that way. And right now the temperature is like 65 degree. And he's still shaking. See it? Which is not normal. Yes, I'm gonna I'm gonna warm him up. And I know you're trying to help me, okay? Thank you. And um it's hard uh to see him like that. Uh but that's the way life goes, I guess. Um so anyway. Um so today uh, that's what I'm talking about. Dog and human can have, um, can be iodine deficiency. And I know, I'm sorry. I'm sorry you're shaking a lot. Look how he's shaking. See how he's shaking? Look at him shaking a lot. And can you stand up so people can see how skinny you are? Stand up for a second. Stand up. Stand up. Up. No. Up. Stay right there. Nope. No. Stand up and stay. 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 Right there. Hold. And see how skinny he is. This happens within, I believe, four months trying to go out as far as I can but I can't about four to six months around there he started to have this a lot and that's how it got me into research okay you can lay down now you can lay down right here lay down right here please thank you and that's how I got into research about iodine deficiency and how I found out and all this stuff so now it's kind of make all sense and um I'm happy to report, though, we are 
uh, doing a lot better and all thanks to these things right here it just um, iodide potassium iodide water potassium iodide and iodine 2% that's it okay and this is called Che Crow's Lugol's Solution 2% okay and no, I am not advertising for these people. I have nothing to do with them. Um, it's just that I read a lot about them. Um, and they've been working really good. Um, he's He actually shiver even more than that. And that's what got me scared, and that's what how I, I got into this episode. Um, so now we take a, we, him and I, uh, we take drops. Now, since we don't know about dog, uh, we don't want it to have like a human dosage, because human dosage might be too high. Um, I have a separate thing for him, and uh, for one liter... Of, of 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 water uh, for human what I what how much I consumed um, for 1.5 liter I do three three drops for him only one drops okay because I don't know uh, you can get overdosed I've read and I've researched and you they say you can get ov overdosed by iodine um, first you have diarrhea and then you will, you know, probably other things. And if you overdose, overdose that, they say you can die. I'm not sure on that. I have not tested on that, but I'm just telling you ahead of time, please do not overdose on them. Um, for me, I first, I, I'm starting now, so I do three. I just did three, um... Oh, I saw, I, sorry, I thought I'd see a fleet. I only do three drops per 1.5 liter. They wanted four drops, actually. I mean, I'm sorry, three to four drops for one liter. But I'm doing 1.5 and only drop three. And I'm doing pretty good so far. Now, for him... Uh, that 1.5, he have a separate bottle, and that 1.5, he only have one drop. Because, like I said, I don't know. But since he's eating food with iodine, uh, potassium iodide in it, um, that would also help. So, that's another thing. Now, since we don't know about things... And see, don't, since we don't know how certain things, like dog this small, you don't want it overdose either. So you just put a little bit in. And that's what I did. Uh, no, this is not from a vet advice or anything. No medical advice or anything. I'm just experimenting myself. But as of that, I don't want to add too much in either. Um, and then I just use like Poland Spring Bottle or Poland Spring Water. Um, PBA, they're both PBA free, of course. Um, PBA plastic, um, free. And that's always, or you're going to have to store them in glass. That's your, your, your second choice right there. But as for, um, taking these drops right here, I've read a lot about these drops. And they don't tell you specifically. Um, because here's the thing about I, I, I research about iodine. Um, is that the um, there is no specific because each person's individual require it differently. So in a way, you would have to be your own doctor. Yep. So, like I said, always start it out on the low first and then go forward. Do you know what I mean? And that's what I did. I started with really low 
and now I'm doing okay. I, I'll see. Um, I got a lot of energy now, and I all I have also researched into EMF too. Um, this is actually related to EMF. It actually took my headaches away. Um, so if anyone, if anybody who watched this and and have followed me about EMF, you might want to look into iodine deficiency. Because here's the thing, they actually treat um, anyone who exposed to radiation with iodine. So that's, there's a connection there. I'll make a different video, but since this is about you know our health and stuff like that i want to throw some of that stuff in so it is related um it does mix how does it taste it tastes a little bit bitter i don't like that but i have no choice i swallow it <laughs> uh but i got a lot of energy now um today so far i've been i've been on like 16 hours yep 16 on hours without sleeping it's amazing but um that's for you to decide of course if you are not iodine deficiency then there's no point of you watching this video but if you are curious about your tiredness about fatigue about shaking because uh last month that's when i got into this because last month my throat was was blowing up and I found this out long ago and I have suspicions and I gone in through all this stuff but I didn't really really go into it until I started to shiver like he does like cold in like 80 degree like 75 degree and I'm shivering can you imagine and that's when I, I started to find out and my throat was blowing up like I couldn't swallow like someone someone like trying to squeeze my my my, my throat like someone's choking me um, all the symptoms I'll list it right here for you and when that happens I started to got scared I said there gotta be something wrong with me and that's how I got into research about iodine deficiency and um, I have been using this uh, for I don't know I think this is uh, almost my second week now and it's been really good I mean I don't know maybe I don't I forgot sorry I forgot what day it is that I order these like I said before I no longer keep track of time um, there's a reason for it it's personal reasons I don't keep track of time anymore but him he's a little slower he's still shiver but he's doing a lot better he was shivering a lot back then but now he's a lot better now uh, Benny don't lick that I'll, I'll clean it for you don't lick that he was outside today um, so now he's licking his fur uh, don't lick that cuz it's my dirty I'll, I'll I'll take us a, a thing you know and I'll clean it for you okay stop okay don't lick that okay anyway so that's how I found out uh, through him and like I said if you see that video up here you will see what I was talking about um, but this is about how I got a little healthier now um, but, but amazingly amazingly how long did it take you only take a few hours for your body to notice that I just dropped two drops in and three um, and three drops in a one liter bottle and I use that little bottle of water uh, because it's a 1.25 liter so it'll be best to, for me to drop three drops in there I fill it up and then I that's how I drink it from there and I stick it in the fridge and I come back and I drink from there any type of water that's what I do now and how long does it take to affect the first day that I actually take these it only took like two hours not even two hours within I would say within 15 minutes I felt like 
10 to 20 pounds just drop off from me, from my body. My body felt lighter. And then, um, I started to fart a lot. Sorry, I had to add that up. I add this into, but hey, it's this is medical, okay? And I don't mind sharing it. Um, I was walking around the store and I started farting a lot. I was like, what the? You know? And next thing you know, I no longer, I stop. I start farting. And I should say gas. Passing gas. Um, I think I did it about maybe six times in the store. And I was like, wow, that's kind of crazy. Within an hour, that's what it does to my body. And then after that, it no, it stops. Everything stops. And then my body became lighter. Like a lot lighter. Maybe I'm releasing gas. Maybe the gas was have was weighing me up, right? And uh, yes, I did have some weight loss too. Um, and that's also with him as well. Um, so it is tied in to iodine deficiency for weight loss. So if you have weight loss, you might want to look into that as well. Um, because it does... It does that with me as well. Um, now for him, he been weight loss. He had, he had. I've been, I've been noticing that for the past four to six months, that he got really skinny, and that's like I said, that's how I got into this venture. And I've read a few, and I also see few videos and stuff like that, and they were talking about dogs having iodine deficiency and and I can confirm that they do and um and that's how I got that's what I've been using I use this product here if anybody curious about this product that's what it is and no I'm not advertising for them I have I'm I, I, I'm not selling them no associated to them or whatsoever I just ordered directly from Amazon because they had it um, about two dollars more, but it was a really fast delivery. Just next day, that's what I had because probably they had somewhere close to my my region. So they uh, once I ordered, the order went through, I guess, and they just it came like the next day uh, with Amazon Prime. That's how I got it next day for free shipping. Um, this here, I got it for $24, so it's $12, $12 each with free shipping. Um, I think there's taxes on it because uh, they sent it to Massachusetts. So, But I will find that link and I will link it to in the description if in case you wanted to buy it. And no, I am not associated to that. I don't know how to uh, advertise any of that stuff. So... Or you can just search, search on, 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 on Amazon yourself. Just search for this right here. Right there. Okay. J. Crow's uh, Lugo's Solution 2%. That's it. And this is the um, two ounce bottle. I got four. Four total. Two bottles. And it came to like $24. So... But anyway, um, so if you are, before I go, um, if you are new to iodine deficiency or anything like that, like remember, just take, um, they said 1.5 liter, or I mean, I'm sorry, one liter every three drops. That's an average, um, but I do 1.25 with three and then see how it goes. Uh, like I said, within 24 hours, you see the difference on your body. And also, you too, is you're going to start gaining a lot of energy. And you feel like, oh my god, I feel like a Superman today. <laughs> I was doing stuff all over the place. And I'm still not tired. Usually, I would be really, my body's really tired and stuff. 
and the weather would be sh making me sh cold and shivering up but I feel really hot right now um, so within it's on I've been on in like two two and a half weeks I think somewhere there I'm not sure when I order that um, I went through with this whole thing already this is my new one that I have to after the video I have to add that into there um, I just dig a hole up here and I add them inside and I shake it um, or you can turn it around the other way up to you um, but it, I find it easier for me to dig a hole right here on top of here and I put my finger on there and I just shake it and then I open it but that's up to you because you need the hole anyway you know how the hole up here to release the water so you need that anyway I'm probably going to get a needle next and inject it in there but anyway that's my thing um the reason why I say that because I have to add it in after the video but anyway so that's how I do it and in case uh, like I said before in case you're new to this um, research about it a little bit if you are EMF sensitive I believe EMF sensitive is tied to this because uh, people who are affected by um, radioactive like uh, what you call that Japan, the Japan or Hikushima whatever that nuclear disaster recently and then they are also the uh, Chernobyl long ago um, I've read about it we study about it in school and I remember that 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 I remember seeing things that they have to take iodine um, iodine uh, tablets they have them in tablets too they got them at the GNC um recently I researched it but I believe uh liquid would would be better it would affect you faster and like I said it'll make you fart in beginning um like crazy and then your body changes somehow like the body changes like it removes gas or something from your body weird but you be on a healthier road that's for sure and also, too, I saw him, uh, improvement in him as well. He got a lot of energy as well. So, in my case, in his case, iodine deficiency does, does fall into dog and human. Um, anyway, um, I guess that's about it on this video. I don't have anything else. If I have anything else, I'll probably make a separate video about EMF because YouTube is like that. It's it's weird. You can't really do certain things, blah, 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 blah. Um, but I'll probably make a separate video on that to make um, uh, EMF sensitive people. It's for EMF sensitive people. Um, but if you've seen, if, if you're subscribed to me and you see that, you don't have to watch it if you're not. But if you are EMF sensitive, uh, you might want to do that as well. But anyway, um, I hope that this is helpful, uh, especially on the dosage wise. Like I stated before and before I go, one more time, I'm no doctor or anything like that. Uh, I'm not planning to be a doctor either. But do your research and always do your research and always take the lowest dosage first and see how your body reacts. Once your body reacts a certain way and you know how your body is, uh, I've seen, I've read posts and I've seen things that people do six drops. Um, so as far as I know is two, four, mine is three drops. So uh, two, four, six and eight, I guess. But I wouldn't go any further than eight drops in the one liter. But one person said she put in six drops. Um, I believe that's a little high for me, but that's just for me. Um, so I started out one liter, or in that case of that bottle right there, is 1.25 liter with three drops. Anyway, and for him, uh, for the dogs, uh, is one liter just for one drops. 1.25 for one drops, which I'm going to make a separate video on that because that way people will know. But anyway, um... That's just, uh, this is a little bit update on, on, on how I'm doing with, with that since I found out. And also some tips about it as well. 
and I hope uh, it'll help someone out there uh, with iodine deficiency or even new to it because it is it, it is a hard journey and it is a hard hard journey and I hope um, if you are one of those people I know how it feels to be like and I know what it's like and if you are uh, I hope you're gonna get some recovery and into a healthier life and into a healthier road because it does work and I can tell you offhand 100% that products works and no I'm not advertising for them they didn't even pay me a penny to be honest so all I can say is for myself and this is a personal journey and I'm, I'm just choosing to share to people and if someone's new and you got questions or anything like that just post it and I would try whatever I could uh, to help uh, because like I said I'm no doctor but at the same time I have been researching about a lot and not because I was researching a lot I study a lot as well anyway I will see you in the next video okay and probably saying bye to Benny too say bye Benny bye